that your love never fails. Lord, your love is forever. And you who began a good work in us, you said that you would be faithful to complete that work. Because of the cross, when Jesus went to the cross and when he shed his blood, he himself says, it is done. It is finished. It is completed. And so, Lord, we're finally free. And we're letting go. And we're trusting and believing in you. Lord, I just thank you right now for your presence over this house and over your people, Lord. You've begun a great work in this church and in your people. And, Lord, we thank you that by the works of the flesh, we can't bring it to pass. It's only a work of your Holy Spirit. And so we're here, Lord, to worship you in spirit and in truth. Lord, we're here, Lord, to surrender. We're here to glory in Christ Jesus and put no confidence in the flesh. So we just thank you for this opportunity this morning. In Jesus' name. Amen. Isn't it good to be in the house of the Lord? Amen. I want you to continue to believe the truth that God loves you. Amen. That is the truth. And that truth is real. Amen. The devil, the Bible says, is a what? He is a liar. He is the father of lies. So when he comes accusing you, putting you down, reminding you of your past, telling you that you're no good. How many, how many would say that, yeah, I've, I've, I've lived, there's some kind of voice telling me, yeah, I'm a failure, I did wrong, I messed up, and, and, I, and I'm not going to make it. Can anybody hear that voice? Yeah. It's out there. And what it's doing is it's killing God's people, amen? And you and I as God's people, we have to learn to tune in to one voice. It's the voice of truth. It's the Holy Spirit, the, the Spirit of truth that dwells inside of you that says, I am beloved, amen, I am God's, and He loves me, and He has made me complete and perfect through the cross this morning. We're going to take communion. This all, this morning is really about you and I coming to the place of the cross and coming back to a place where we believe in God, we believe in His love, we believe in His truth, we believe in the forgiveness of sins, amen. We believe that we're redeemed, that we are going to heaven, amen. That's what it's all about. So just put on a spirit of faith as we worship the Lord. I want to introduce a new song, and it's called How Can It Be? And I just want you to marvel. Maybe you're sitting in your seat, in your seat this morning, or up on this stage this morning, just saying, how can God love me? I just want you to know and understand this morning that God truly loves you. So Father, I pray in Jesus' name, again, that you love and just permeate all of our hearts and minds and beings this morning. Let us be swallowed up in your great ocean of love this morning. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen.